Hey YouTubers, Electric Adventures here. Um, still on holidays, so um, not on YouTube very much. Um, just came back to resupply, wash clothes, and things like that. And, um, that was a package. Of them, so this is one I've forgotten about. So all the way from Japan. Um, you never know. I mean, I I'm, did remember all of these, just that they've come, probably come quite a bit quicker than I was expecting, because it only listed International Mail Service. So. Never know. So in here we have some shrink wrapped titles. I'm sure those in the know will probably even from that quick flash guess what they might be. Um, so this is not for the um, primary collection of either Saturn or our Mars system. But this is for one of the other systems that I do well, I can play ga play the games on a lot. So on the system, really, I'm after shooters and um, shooters and other interesting games in in my category. So they are both for the PC Engine. And I managed to get a copy of. Um, I can't remember which one this is now. Alien. But well, anyway, it's the pinball. Um, recently uh, reviewed by Crow. So blame him for this one. Um, I'll take him down below. I'll, I'll find the video that reviews this and, and um, include a link down below for him. Um, but um, yes, no, very, very. I see it's called Alien Storm or something like that. Uh, we'll, we'll plug it in after this and give it a go. But it's a really nice looking pinball game and shows how good the PC Engine is. And, um, and this other one, you can blame BitEd1000 for this one. Um, he was talking about one of his favourite games ever, Dungeon Explorer. And I really like Dungeons and Dragons adventure type games, although I haven't had as much time as I would like to play these sort of games. And um, this popped up quite cheap, so I was actually looking for the other one and uh, managed to get a copy of this. So it's in, you know, uh, pretty good nick. There's only a little bit of um, peel lift there. Let's have a look inside. So we've got the Who card with its cover, it's coming slightly out. The um, the manual is part of the um, of the inslip. There we go. So, a little bit of detail and everything like that of the characters and everything like that. So this will be very interesting. Uh, I didn't show you the inside of that one, so we've even got a little bit of um, uh, padding they put in to stop the cases from cracking, which is good. And the manual and the hue card with its cover, so all they're all complete. And um, yeah, I mean it's all in all in Japanese, of course. There's a couple of good little pickups there. So I've um, I've been away at our. We have another property um, uh, place near um, a place called Port Arthur in Tasmania. Uh, yes, where the convict settlements are. Uh, it's on the Tasmanian Peninsula, um, and down there I can get wireless. Uh, internet, but obviously the um, the download quota is quite limited, so I'm very limited in the um, YouTube videos I can watch at the moment. Uh, and plus, you've got to wait for them to buffer before you can watch any that you do to choose to watch anyway. Um, and there seems to be some sort of limit down there, so even if you do uh, try and watch something, sometimes you can watch two videos and then you get cut off for a little while and you have to come back later. Um, but I will try and watch as many as I can and do it and continue commenting where I can. But otherwise, um, I'll be back um, online fully in about uh, another 10 days' time. All right, um, this, this is just a quick um, pick up, and I will go and play those games and put some video up of them. Okay. Right, here we have Alien Crush, that's what the name of the title was, for the um, PC Engine. Let's go for slow, my well, first game. Uh, you've got two different two musics you can select, which is rather nice. Ooh. Uh, maybe you should have adjusted the controls a little bit first because we've got. Joystick controlling one side, and one of the buttons controlling the other. 
Now they're quite good pinballs because you've always got um, you know bosses to defeat and try and kill like in the mini games. So we've got to try and kill this centipede. Hit him on the head. That's it. So it just really shows the colour capabilities of the uh, PC engine. Okay, so we've got three holes, so we've got three of these to defeat. Oops, we went down. That's... So we didn't quite defeat him, but... Oops, ah! So it's just in, you know, a really interesting table layout and quite an interesting... You know, pinball all out because of the um, theme. There we go, we've got a three times point run. Get up to the top here. Mini game. Ooh. So I'm not very good at it, but um, this is an excellent pinball. And lots of mini challenges to go through and everything like that. Obviously makes it a bit more complicated to play. Oops. Oh. And lost the ball. Right, that's excellent. Let's move on to the next one. I'll definitely be adding that to the regular playlist. Right, here we go with Dungeon Explorer. Now, I've never played this game before, so... Right, so you can enter a password to um, to save your game from previous things. So we need a fighter. Let's run around the fight. I mean, obviously I. You know, oh, I've got some ability. So you need to go around the village, go to various places, and um, talk to different people. Obviously, get a bit of candy text to get past, but still, we have maybe I'll adjust the options. Let's see if I can get, find my way out of the village. I find a monster to bash up. We've got wandering monsters to deal with. Oops, not very good. Okay, run for a revive. This 
maybe one of those ones where I need to um, read some online instructions before I dive into it too much. There we go, got some potion. And we keep on coming out of those holes all the time. not very good at it um, I'll definitely have to get some um, English instructions out and maybe fiddle around and see whether I can get the text in um, in English as well all right there's my quick pick up and plays and I'll catch you all next time I'll uh, put a link to both crow and um, bid ed 1000 to because um, they're the ones that inspired me to get these titles okay thanks guys catch you next time